Alright, so this is going to have to be my little setup for now so I can show what I'm going to do. This is the two fish that I did from earlier. They've been marinating in the fridge all day. So, they're ready. They're well seasoned and they're done. These now are the two fish that we need to do. So, come Abby. This is the fish. So basically, the first thing that I always do is put a slit in the fish for better seasoning purposes. So I put a slit here. Just a small slit. I don't know if you can see it. And I'm going to put one right here, just like that, just to slice inside the fish. is make sure that we season the fish properly. The seasonings that I use are Lari's fish seasoning and I like this because it has all spice in there which really brings out a lot of flavor and um, you know fish and some black pepper and that's it for now okay. So what we're gonna do is wait what did you put on there? stuff it into the slits so that way it marinates it brings the seasoning inside of the slit of the fish the side so I normally have to use this to kind of cut it right here so that it stays leveled if you guys know what I mean all right you guys so the pot is ready I know this because it almost I almost lost the eye all right so <laughs> I'm basically gripping the fish like that these are the snappers by the way I'm just gonna put it in like that <laughs> Mm. Mm. It's oh my god, it smells so good. And it's popping out even like it's too close. It's okay. It's hey, a that's too much rice, babe. I told you. This is the rice I cooked, y'all. I want some of that chicken rice. It smells so good in here. So yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I flipped the fish, and this is basically what it looks like right now. All right, guys, this is the grunts. Then I'm going to come back and show you what they look like when I cook them down, okay?
on the camera, y'all. So we're putting the fish in the um in the pot now in the sauce. So I'm just basically getting some sauces and putting it over the fish like that so that it can cook down. All right. And now for the next fish, put that all the way at the bottom so that we can fit the two small ones. There we go. There we go. You move the dressing and let the fish slide into the juice. There we go. And then you grab some of the seasonings and dress her on top. There we go. Good job, Abby. Thanks. If I had a cover, I would cover it up so that um, the steam can run through the fish one more time and just let all these flavors bind up together. But I don't have a cover for this, so I'm just going to leave it like that. And um, we will basically turn it off in the next five to six minutes. All right, guys, so that was it. We showed you how we Jamaican style cook fish. So, so this is Sissy. She now knows how to cook fish escobie style boom <laughs> so yeah so it's friday night we're getting on the prayer line now and um yeah so this was our friday that's ray y'all you're not gonna say bye bye teacher bye, I have sorrow. he's about to drink his sorrel it's a island drink for those who don't know who, what sorrel drink is but yeah anyway so, we thank you so much for watching. Please thumbs up this video. Please, please, please. And subscribe if you have not done so already for more videos from me and Hugs and the fam. And I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And good night. Mm -hmm. Happy Sabbath. Bye.